hi this is Anna welcome back to my channel today I, I would like to share with you a few things I would like to show you these two journals and then also ephemera packs that I have at my shop couple tassels that I made and also um, paper clips um, not paper clips mm, charms all sorts of charms that I made so um, first I'm going to show you the journals so these are pretty much uh, clean journals they don't have any embellishment any ephemera in them this is why I want to show you how they would look with the ephemera so they have uh, each signature is made with 14 different pieces of paper or fabric or whatever it is and there are four signatures in each book so it's uh, still over two inches uh, wide. I mean, the spine is. And these are golden books, as you can see. And I picked these two. Um, these two particular ones is because this one is I Can Fly. So it's, it kind of looks to me like, um, I don't know, maybe because of these, um, this, this, this pattern here. It looks like maybe leaves flying in the air or something and then this one because it's family so you know fall Thanksgiving family time so this is why these two and there was one more that I made but I added ephemera and that was about the how do lions say I love you I think it was so then these two are made with the same paper as um, the other book except that this one don't have any embellishments any decoration so I'm going to show you really quick and I left this um, fabric here the way it is so you can add lace or other trims to it so um, I left it uh, to your imagination so here's the book I added a little bit Inca gold because there was like some stains or something so I added blue Inca gold on the front and I really like how this color works with the cover and then green color uh, threads so this one had something here so um, I covered this with this book belongs to stamp this I'm mentioning this isn't very straight but that's because I was thinking that you can add your own trim to it and all the pages are in order so as you can see a lot of journaling space beautiful paper I picked the paper thinking of fall brown bag to add some goodies to great for stamping or collaging or something week schedule visit a museum be it science history or art here go on a, a scavenger hunt with some friends So a lot of space you can add so many things to this coffee dyed paper doily so I just really want to go fast to this and so you can see um, the detail inside and I love this paper is the second signature directions for recipes and I have some catalog book pages I mean catalog pages or magazines or something this I thought looked really cool for a fall journal here's the mesh that I'm using in all the fall journals so as you can see very eclectic And um, you can make it your own. Variety of papers, as I mentioned, I was trying to uh, make them in a full theme. So this is why those 
uh, greens and all these fall colors here. <clears throat> Here's a little pocket. This house. So it's white and off-white lined paper. There are no digitals. Book pages, calendar pages. Oh, this is such a pretty page. It's the middle, so maybe some crafting project ideas. Definitely some fall projects. Coffee dyed, coffee filter. See, like for example, here love makes the world go around, family makes the ride worthwhile. So, very family oriented. September, so there's like few pages from September calendar. This I thought maybe when you go pick up some leaves or do some other um, projects outside. This is junk mail envelope so you can put something inside and I covered the print here. This looks like sweater for fall uh, and fall colors. This is gilded, I don't know if you can see this paper. Birds, beautiful fall trees. Here's the other side of the envelope, happy fall. This is great space for notes. So not just for kids, these books I think would be great for just anybody. And here's this one, I can fly. I added some Inca gold, I'm not sure what color it is. Um, I don't know, looks like copper, but I'm not sure which color I used. And then here again you have for signatures as you can see not finished so you can finish it or you can leave it just the way it is to look a little rustic for fall and again first and last signature are with made with the original pages Beautiful butterflies. <laughs> I like this broom. So, as you can see, pretty much the same paper. Second signature here again is some gilded paper. That's such a pretty page too. <laughs> this week do your back to school shopping. <laughs> Cute. So here again I covered the print. So that's a pocket right here. Really pretty. And this coffee looks good here, really good. And here's the other side of the envelope so whatever you put in here it will be visible through the window there's 
so pretty. Birds. Middle of the journal. Here we have garlic. I hope I'm not going too fast. I just really want to show you the pages so you see more or less um, how the journals look inside. I love this paper here. Pretty. And this says October. And here again are tomatoes. And I really like how these two pages <laughs> look so cool together. <laughs> look at this mouse. <laughs> this looks so homey, doesn't it? The flowers in the, in the window. And here's the pocket. These beautiful leaves. And this is again this gilded beautiful paper. Yeah, this is so homey. Grateful, blessed, so very thankful family. Oh, this is perfect for a picture. Happiness. Uh, live every moment. Uh, love every day. Love beyond measure. And these owls, this, this, I love this page too, with the leaves on the side. Isn't this pretty? And here's the pocket. So that's the end. So now let me show you the tassels maybe first. So these tassels come with um, this uh, small lobster clasp. It's 12 uh, millimeters. And even though you don't have tassel attachment on these books, because I didn't make tassel attachment, um, I'm looking for a smaller paper clip. You can add a paper clip to it, put it on a paper clip, and just, uh, just clip it. <laughs> and there it is. It sits on a paper clip, and it looks really pretty. Adds a lot of color and charm to the journal. So that's how it looks. And there are beads on it, as you can see. And this tassel is um, yellow and uh, red colors and some browns. So here are the beads. So you can see this kind of like clear brown, and there's yellow, some reds, pearls, and stuff. So that's the tassel here. Now, this journal, I already put the paper clip on this one, so I'm just going to clip it on a paper clip. Because this one has more green in it, so I think it works better. I just made these tassels, uh, I wasn't thinking about the journals, I just made the tassels, so. Um, this one, as you can see, has more green and red and stuff, dark brown. So here are the beads. So it looks pretty with the tassel. And the, the tassels are very long, so they're even longer than the journal. And then I also have all sorts of these little things. And they're very pretty too. 
So look at this one. This is such a cute image. And there are pilgrims and stuff and butterflies. There's a turkey. Here is a butterfly. I have a few butterflies. And happy Thanksgiving. So all sorts of things. So for example, you could even add it to this tassel here. Let me see if I can do this here. Can't see very well what I'm doing, but so you see, you can add extra stuff to it. So I'm going to link the tassels and I'm going to link the charms too, so you can find them if you follow the links. And I also wanted to show you the ephemera. So I have, I have these in a set of three. So, and I really love this one. Look at these pilgrims, a cute couple. So, and then I have an owl, really cute. This would look pretty with this I Can Fly journal. There's sunflower. Oh, this one would look pretty here. Well, anyways, I just want to show you this ephemera really quick and what's included. So it's 30 pieces. 30 pieces of ephemera and I prepared um, five packs it actually took me some time so so there are leaves and die cuts I love these die cuts and then uh, stickers those are those foam stickers leaves and I made um, mushrooms Cute mushrooms to add somewhere. Um, then I stamped hello fall, grateful, thankful. So you get these things, couple tickets, and ephemera ticket, flower here, tag. These are cool for these journals. Then there is a button for the flower. I was uh, thinking specifically of the flower. Of course, you could, you know, you could do. Uh, you could make your own tags and stuff with these smaller pieces. Then there's manila tag that's stamped, inked around. And I have this cute little envelope. You can put some stuff inside of it. So it's stamped leaf. Comes with a paper clip. Then the um, index, vintage index library cards. They're also stamped and come with yarn. There's bingo card. Uh, index cards stamped another stamped index card with uh, fabric here this one is also stamped doily and cluster of these things here you can add to a journal then there's this tag and I left threads on this one so it's double-sided paper with leaves and guest check so you could you know you could you could add um, you could add the ephemera to the journal so you could create something you could glue it you could ink it around you could uh, make a tuck spot with it so you would glue it right here right here you would ink it around it and you could for example put this inside sticking out a little bit you could um for those leaves you could add a leaf to decorate it you could do all sorts of things with it and um, these pieces let me see this one for example you could make a pocket with this one uh, so you would glue it here and then you could put this inside or you can make collages with the bingo card. Uh, let's see. You could put a couple tags inside. This side or this side. So, you know, you could play around with this. You could add this on the side or the other sticker that I had. I can't find it here 
could put a sticker on this side. So look at what a pretty page it is right now when you add all these things to it. Or you could um, could add bingo card. You could add this. You could actually fold this in half and have the other side coming to this page here and then it will balance this white because you would add some white to this page here. So you could have this, then you could glue this on top of that. Then, um, let me see, things are falling. You could maybe add a uh, leaf and mushroom to it. You know what I mean? You could really make these pages look really pretty and uh, add more full, full uh, stuff to it. Or even this, you could just clip it right in here and it would look pretty. You could add this behind it or in front of it. There's many, many possibilities. And I love these two. So you could, you could glue this here. You could, if it's, if it's sticking out and you don't like it, then you can trim it off a little bit could add this to it here and um, <laughs> just um, it's a lot of fun it really is a lot of fun so look look how cute this would look like I mean this would look <laughs> really cute isn't this pretty <laughs> so anyways that's what this ephemera is for to decorate your fall projects and then you know you have all sorts of tickets and stuff and it's um so it's 30 pieces but it gives you a start it gives you a good start so could even stick it here maybe clip it so it doesn't move so a lot of possibilities or to the side you could do that too could clip it to the side. Now this one is also pretty page here. So you could even add this here because there's some green stuff and blue on this side. So you could add this here. And you could, because there's brown here, so you could add this brown maybe here. And maybe make it a tax, but maybe not. Maybe it's just a list. So then uh, add thankful somewhere, somewhere to it, you know, that would really, this looks really pretty with the other page, doesn't it? And this is also gilded, I can see the gold on the edge. But anyway, so th that's the ephemera, so at least you could get a good look at, at it, at the pieces. And um, so I'm going to link the journals, the ephemera, the charms, and the tassels. So you can check them out at my shop. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed um, the stuff. And please subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.